Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. We're going grocery shopping today and we have three stores we're going to. We're kicking Walmart out of this grocery shopping trip and we're just gonna go to Sam's Club, we're gonna go to Aldi and we're gonna go to Meyer. And look who's with me. Hi. <gasps> yes! My Ziny Heine is with me. So we are doing our lovely little grocery shopping this week and uh, we've got some good stuff planned. So I hope you're ready for that excitement. Um, it's raining outside as per usual. You know, when I was a kid, I used to take flute lessons on Tuesdays and every Tuesday it rained. I sort of feel like now, every time I go grocery shopping, it's raining. What's up with that? I don't know. But first things first, we're gonna go get paper towels. Not a typical thing I buy at a weekly shop. It's usually why once a month grocery haul. But you know, sometimes you use them up faster than you expect and we need some paper towels. So let us go, my friends, let us go. I haven't gone this way in a while. Usually I go down the other aisle first, but you know, you gotta switch things up in life and make it crazy. As promised, paper towels, 1998 for this guy. He's gonna last us a while. We used to go through paper towels a lot more. I don't know, I think the kids are just getting cleaner and we don't need them quite as much. So they've been lasting a long time, but that's going in the cart. Now those are some pretty paper plates for spring. That's a big old honker for 10 bucks. 50 of them and then they have this little egg one too I'm not buying them but they're fun those are cute riley seasoning is an order for tonight 598 for this guy um this one is made in a town about maybe an hour or two away from us but i think they sell to sam's clubs around the place so if you ever want just like a general all-purpose seasoning, you know what we use this on? We use it on turkey burgers and we use it on uh, some pasta, like just sprinkle it on. I don't know, one of my kids really likes it. Actually, all the kids used to like it, but they've changed their ways except for one. So, $5.98. Because I try to buy the love of my children. <laughs> no, just kidding. Crunch berries for $5.92. Our last little um, cereal buying lasted us a good long while so now it's time for some more yummies i just walked by this cereal it is a strawberry banana nut cereal i think called seven days if you're into the keto world i think this one is really keto friendly it says right there at the top it's on clearance for 9.91 i'm not getting it but i want to show you the yummy stuff that's in there it looks like what no sugar added no gluten what am i seeing here strawberry banana nut looks like some I don't know, pumpkin seeds in there? Walnut or pecans? Okay. It's just a good, oh, here we go. Almonds, coconut, sunflower seeds, dates, pecans, pumpkin seeds, coconut oil, flax, chia, strawberries, bananas, and vanilla extract. You know, I make granola, not with this many exciting things, but I do make my own granola. Anybody else? I'm gonna be making some more, so I just started that and it's been fun. The kids like it a lot. I'm looking for some more ground turkey. Five pounds of this, and it's $15.98 for the five pounds of it. I just dish it out into like one pound increments and freeze them flat, and they're very easy to uh, get going for a quick lunch for the kids. Can I just say that if you want some fantastic romaine hearts that last a long time, Sam's Club is where it's at. $4.78 for the six count. Man, you can use this for anything. Anything and everything, it's so good. Several things that I am making coming up are gonna take some lemons, 428 for these fellas. Let's see what uh, what we got. Man, Sam's Club again knows how to do it upright with the lemons, they're so good. We're gonna have a live on Saturday and I'm doing a Greek themed live and it's gonna be, it's gonna be good. These are not speaking to me though. Come on, Sam's Club, don't, don't mess with me. All right, I think that's the one right there, doing it. Also, I'm going, I'm not gonna tell you what I made. Well, I'm not getting those, that one was weird. But um, I'm not gonna tell you what I'm gonna make, but just think Greek and cucumbers and you'll know. 398, get in the three pack. Also, I'm gonna get the Gala apples here for 798. Let's just say the reason why, could I get them cheaper elsewhere for sure? Do I think that the quality is very worth the price? Absolutely. So I'm gonna go for that. Zion, you're about to get booted out. Look at ya. How are you gonna fit with all the food? <sighs> Have we talked about these New York cheesecake bites? Do they not look delish? I'm not getting them, but 
case you are interested, they do look quite beautiful. Mm. Ooh, look at this. Creamy poblano chicken enchiladas. <gasps> They're on instant savings right now. Three bucks off. I could make those. I'm gonna be making my own tortillas soon. Just get ready. They're not gonna be flour tortillas though, corn tortillas. But I did make naan bread the other day and that was delicious. Now I'm gonna be making um, pita bread. Pita bread's coming up. For all of our smoothie goodness, triple berry blend going in. And the kids have been wanting to try a mango banana pineapple, like their own little creation with some orange juice and milk. And I'm gonna be doing that. so. I'll show it to you sometime. I think it's gonna be good, right? Is today the day that I buy eight pounds of tater tots? Is that a thing? 11.28, will I be able to fit that in my freezer? Oh man, yeah, yeah. It's just a good thing to have around, okay? Okay. Some toasty uh, sandwich crackers, the peanut butter ones. 8.78 for the big old pack of them. We've been slowing down on these, but still eating them at a fairly good pace. So we'll add them to the to the goodness of our cart. Oh, have you guys seen this before? This is a limited time flavor, cheesy garlic bread flavored chips. Who's tried those and what were your thoughts on them? Very, I would love just some cheesy garlic bread, not chips that are flavored that way, but just, I just like to eat it, really. Doesn't that sound tasty? Yeah. Also, um, I have a feeling that this will be part of the Easter celebration at our house because my kids love Kinder Joy. And look at there's 12 of them in a box. I mean, is this the way we're headed now with the egg prices? We've got to get them in a box, although this is very expensive, but actually not all at the same time. Well, Zai Zai, guess what? We're going to go check out. Are you ready? Check out what? <laughs> we're going to go check out at the register. Can I do that? Child? Yeah, you want to be my helper? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. My name is Red. All right, you ready? Is Red. All right, see. And everyone's name is Red. See, go. <laughs> you, you do it. Got a girl. Ready for the next one? Right there at the lines, yeah? Uh, 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 uh. Now we got to get the cold stuff into our cold bag. Got a girl. There's so much power. Isn't there so much power in being able to be the the guy? What guy? The guy that does the doing. That does the button. Here we go. Yes. Sam's Club total today was 117.69. 117.69. We're gonna go walk out those doors, put everything in the car, and head over to Aldi. Let's go. Aldi knew we were ready for a party, so party size wavy potato chips. Come on now. They are 278. Oh, it looks like they're no. I was gonna say they're on sale. I lie. <laughs> Here we go. Look at these gorgeous strawberries. $1.69. Wow. Big savings. They are so beautiful. I'm gonna go ahead and grab three containers of them and then I've been telling you guys I put them in jars when I get home and they last so long. You know my cilantro situation where I love cilantro and we buy it every week. So I started putting it in a jar when I got home and it lasted us like two and a half weeks. I was so excited. And I just changed out the water periodically, but it is time, we used it all up. So cilantro for 85 cents, as well as we're gonna grab some parsley for $1.29, and I imagine I'm going to store them very similarly, unless you guys tell me otherwise. Blackberries for the win today. I want some blackberries, man, I just love blackberries. Anybody else? $1.99 for those guys, they're going in the cart. I was gonna get broccoli here, but I'm not really impressed with the broccoli, so I'm gonna pass. Hard pass, friends, hard pass. 219 for these lovely little olives. I'm gonna give them a try. I've been struggling to find new olives because the ones that I love, well, they're not, they're not selling them right now. And I don't know why, it makes my heart so sad. So we're gonna give these a go for a little something something we're gonna be making, but I'm not gonna tell you, but all the clues are there. So I'm sure you've guessed it. The kids have been begging to do s'mores and I'm not mad about it. So I think what we're gonna do is invite our neighbors over and do a little bonfire out in the backyard. And uh, that means that we're gonna need some graham crackers, $1.95. So we're gonna do some for the little gathering and uh, some for just having snacks, right? Two of them I think will be just fine. How many of you are cinnamon graham cracker fans and how many of you are just the plain honey goodness? I would say that I'm more in the honey, although chocolate is delightful, but that option's not here right now, so, you know. 
paprika we were running low and that is how i make my yummy mahi mahi or tilapia seasoning 97 cents for this guy so i'm very glad to be getting another container of this how many of you are into fish anybody what's your favorite way to eat fish and what is your favorite fish i tried flounder the other day very i don't know it fell apart so fast i would say my favorite might be tilapia salmon is close by Mahi Mahi is good as well. No celebration is complete without the marshmallows. If we're gonna have a bonfire and we're gonna do s'mores, well, we're gonna need marshmallows, are we not? Uh, 99 cents for the bag of these beauties. We're gonna need a block of feta cheese for our Greek goodness that's gonna be going on with our live this weekend and probably beyond because I'm gonna be eating it and it's gonna be good. 2.99 for this guy, eight ounces great price. Look at the milk price. I like it. $2.47. Now I do have a special coupon for Meyer for 50 cents off of milk there. And so it'll save me, but I can only get one container and I need um, three altogether. Three? Does that sound right? Yeah, I think so. Maybe four. Ooh, I think I'm going to go for four. Okay. So I'm going to get three here, one at Meyer. $2.47 for the 2% milk. Also, these egg prices are just divine. $2.22. I need, I think I'm gonna buy three of these guys. We've been, we've been egging it up. So three containers of it for $2.22 each. We're headed to the self-checkout and then I'll give you guys the total. All right, we are done at Aldi and our total was $37.19. We filled up uh, most of our bags. One of them, two of them have milk in it. So it's not as exciting, but we are going to go put this in the car and then head over to Meyer to finish out our night. This is kind of a fast night. I like it. All right, we've got mangoes that we're going to add to the list today because we're going to try those mango smoothies. Plus, we've just been enjoying eating mangoes in general. So let's see what we've got here. Kind of soft feeling, although ripe when soft. So I'm going to just grab one. There's a seven for seven deal going on right now. So we'll see if we can find anything else around the store that's part of that deal. But one mango for now it is. Today we're getting organic bananas, not because we're trying to be fancy, but mainly because I just, well, let me show you. Here's why. Here's why. Um, they're gone. So they're 69 cents, but Meyer is giving a little M perk coupon for 25 cents off. So that gives me a nice little savings and brings it down to just about, well, actually a little bit less than what they would cost if uh, I was buying the regular ones. So sometimes you just gotta take one for the team and that's what we're doing today. For our yummy little Greek goodness, we need some tomatoes. I'm not gonna get too many of them. I think like three of them. So maybe that's kind of a lot, I don't know, but they are a dollar fifty nine a pound and shouldn't be too much. We're just gonna be making some entomatadas again and I'm really excited about it. So I need some more cheese. Five seventy nine for this beauty. I'm really excited to make it. I just really, really excited. Okay. I really need the green beans to be good. They're not so good. They're just I don't know, they look they look sad. So I'm gonna have to skip the green beans for this time. Sad. We have a store close to our house. It's a little pricey, but their green beans are usually like brilliant, amazing, and not a terrible price, but okay. I guess we're gonna do that. For that little yummy salad I'm making, I just need one pepper. They're 85 cents each, and these are looking quite beautiful, might I say. Okay, there it goes. Actually, you know what's looking good are these green beans. I won't microwave them, but um, we've had these before and they actually look really delish. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab these guys. Big old bag. Just one loaf of bread today, $1.95. Uh, slowing down on the bread, I guess. I don't know. We've just got enough, that's all. Also, some hamburger buns. I am going to make some homemade ones and I just haven't gotten to it. So uh, we'll buy these and then hope I make them too. If anything, we'll just freeze them and all be well. $1.65 for the Meyer brand of hamburger buns. Ooh, my extra sharp cheddar cheese, a block of it, and I'm just gonna grate it up and eat it up and delight in it. And it's gonna be good. So $3.89 for that fella. Pretzels, $2.19 for the sticks. I did notice, look at, they're changing their packaging. I kinda like the old one better. What is happening to me in my old age? I don't like all this change. I think one is good. 
Taco night is not complete without some chips. Two sixty nine for these fellas right here. Look at this sweet little pumpkin, looking so grown up. Uh oh, she's been distracted. Don't look, Zion. Keep walking. Don't think about it. Uh <laughs> I know I would save if I ordered the Wheaties from Sam's Club because I don't have it in store, but I don't have time to order it at the moment. So $5.29, I think I'm going to grab two of the boxes of Wheaties. Zion says she's got a hankering for Raisin Bran, so they are $3.99 for the box. Two for five if you buy two or more, but I'm not doing that today. So she's getting some raisin bran what are waffles without a little syrup to make the heart happy so so many options but we're just going to go with the old original meyer uh one of my kids is enjoying the pure maple syrup so they've been having that some of the others not so much uh this guy i think is what 219 there's the price there we go <laughs> newman's own mild salsa it's a 369 for this guy right here Ezra put in a little request for, we call them the bow tie or the butterfly noodles, $1.89 for the box of those cuties. So I'm getting my one gallon of 2% uh, milk here at Meyer because I get 50 cents off. So it'll be 208 for the gallon. And of course we check the dates cause we're good. We need to use this Faye for several things and it's 6.49, it's like a plain yummy yogurt and it just works with so many things. Yo Place Smooth Yogurt, two strawberries for $3.29 each. It's getting busy over there, so I'm telling you here, but there's the other one right there. Two cans of pineapple chunks in their juice for some of those yummy smoothies with the mango and the uh, banana and the orange juice and the milk and all the good stuff. $1.39 for these each. Well, I do declare, look what's on sale for our yummy little uh, cookout thing, s'mores, $5.49 for a six pack of the Hershey. Now this is special dark, they don't have the other kind, but that's what we're gonna go with. They haven't had our chocolate ice cream in forever, but it is $2.79. So I'm gonna get the mint chocolate chip for the kids and then maybe find one other thing and hope for chocolate some other time. Cookies and cream is our other choice for tonight, $2.79. We had a serious bathroom situation, so we had to cut the end of that video short so we could rush home and uh, I didn't get to give you the Meyer total. So, for the good old Meyer, we had some M Perks, $12.55 from the M Perks. I know that if you spend so much through the Meyer app, you know, you go around the store and then you put your numbers in when you get to the register, it saves it all, whatever. So, so I had an $8 off thing for like a reward thing that I had earned and then $4.55 of other savings that I had. Specials around the store, $1.10. That's what I saved. So a total of $13.65 was my little savings there. So like my milk, 50% off. So it turned out to be $2.08. And what else? The cereal for the boxes of Wheaties, they were 50 cents off each. And then the ice cream was 75 cents off of one of them. Hey. So I got some good deals. Anyway, my total there for Meyer was $81.22. Total for Meyer, 81.22. The grand total for Sam's Club, Aldi, and Meyer all together was $236.10, right on the money. So, that's a big weekly one, but you know, we didn't get quite as much at our once a month grocery haul. So I think some of these weeklies are a little bit more than normal, and that's okay, that just happens, it's life. But um, we got what we need, and we're gonna be filled up with all the good stuff. So, if you guys uh, wanna see me do our little authentic Greek uh, cooking, I would love for you to join us for the live, which comes on Saturday. And I will put out like a, get ready, I'll schedule the live and you'll see it. So you'll be able to get it for your time zone and uh, hopefully come and hang out with us. We chat and talk and have so much fun. We've got people from all over the world that come and talk and hang out with us. and. We really, really enjoy doing that. So Saturdays at 12 Central Standard Time, and then you'll see the scheduled thing and you can figure out what that is for your time zone. So hope that you can make it to that. And I really appreciate you hanging out with me today. Make sure you come on back for all the fun and we'll talk to you really, really soon. Say goodnight. Good night. <laughs> Bye guys.